It's much fancied to go all the way to the grand final. So a key for this York side is, is get off to a good start and, and really take it to Wigan. Yeah, it is the York City Knights running left to right in their white shirts and the home side, Wigan, in their traditional red. And they will have three York players to bring her to the floor. Overloading the near side here, Wigan, looking for their opening score of the match. Cut out pass, they cut out Molyneux as oh, well. That could be the try. score. That does it. It's Rebecca Greenfield, the fullback, back in the starting lineup and back scoring tries for Wigan. Yeah. Rebecca Greenfield, try saver at one end, try scorer at the next. Fantastic work from her, really. It was a beautiful shape as well. It was Molyneux, no, it wasn't, sorry. We're here with Molyneux carry. And it goes out the back. And again, into, Green Shield, uh, into Greenfield hands, sorry. And it's a beautiful little try. Tamsin Renoff. She plays the ball, Hardy gets up and plays dummy half, Peach, Rhiannon Marshall, the handoff, one more pass might do it, it's enough for Katie Langan, and the captain scores, and the York City Knights have their first points of the match. Beautiful try, and once again, it all comes about through that girl Marshall, I spoke about her before, and I mentioned the pre-game really, she gets her hands on the ball, and she's, she, she's very, very skillful, but... You know, what about the kick? The kick had to come out of yardage here. I'm not quite sure this, that she actually really means this sort of kick. I think she's just looking for the get out of a get out of jail kick, really. Just punt the ball down the other end. But it's Andre's chase and willingness to not give up on the on the play. And she's able to have the presence of mind to pick it up and dancing around one, two, three, four, five, six players. Gets the six again. But it's from here. It's Hardy to Peach, to Marshall, pumps the ball, big fend, and finds Langen. What they've done in that first half, and, and to be at six all, really, and not really having a chance of, but here, introducing Andrade, Andrade she bursts through the defensive line, Andrade's off oh, to the races, past another one, and she's in, Savannah Andrade, yeah. that was top class stuff. Now, such a great hard line, and she's such a strong runner of the ball. I was saying there as we head in towards the final moments of this second half that York will be pretty happy knowing that they can play much better. We haven't really seen the best of them in this half. You know, York, uh, sorry, Wigan have had so much sort of field position and, and territory, but it's here once again. York not really been too much in this half, but it's a beautiful ball by Langan and that line there. You know, not the best attempt of a tackle there by Bagley, but she has to take and make the most of it. Really. Adding something, but this this interchange for York ain't bad either. Opportunity on the far side. They put it through the hands. They might well score again. And they're over. Hands in the air all round. Hugs all round for York City Knights. That's another excellent score. Yeah, beautiful work there. It's that lady again, Marshall just stands up as a first receiver playing loose forward but so often she plays like a an additional half of this York City Knights we see here Peach's distribution from nine is on the money it's perfect into Marshall's hands catch and pass catch and pass to Hardy and it's here there we run off she just shows the ball Tommy half she's got Marshall to her right here is Marshall short ball oh, this time clever. that's quite a line and it could be oh. some try for York they're just short another last ditch uh, desperation from Wigan what but, a line from Woods still on for York and they're in the corner try yeah. awarded perhaps there was a question mark over the grounding but talk about upping the ante in the right part of the field. The York City Knights had their fourth try of the afternoon. Absolutely. We can take it back to the play earlier. Even fooled us upstairs, really, with Marshall's short ball. You know, it looked like she was going out the back, and it was just a beautiful... Yeah, almost like she turns her head, really, and a short ball. But for me, it's when they change defence into attack. They're the first ones to dive on the loose ball. And it's here in Wood. First one to scrap on the ball. From there, it goes tip lady to Marshall. And look at this, a lovely short ball there to Wood again, who's involved in two massive parts of the play. But it's Wigan who deny them. The defence is screaming the left edge, screaming to get over. And it's this ball here from Hendry to Lambert for a put down in the corner. Yep, they're a newly assembled side, this York City Knights ladies outfit, but they are 
blending light nicely now towards the end of this season, right where it counts. And that is the final whistle. And it is applause and hugs all round for the York City Knights. They have come here to Wigan and they have withstood the early storm from the Wigan Warriors. And they've come up with a big win. Four tries in all to York. And they have won it by 20 to 6. Carl, your final thought.